Uh, I love this one's a little bit brighter, That's bringing right, in yeah. more of the whites. I'm yeah. noticing right off the bat the cabochons immediately mm -hmm, on yeah. this one. So this one has 376 pieces of hand cut art glass and nearly 196 thick, thick cut jeweled cabochons. It's 24 inches high, 16 inches in the width, and it's $45 and change on your charge card. It has these beautiful serrated glass to the greens the down green, here. The green. Yeah. yeah. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah, and they say you're supposed to have a little bit of green in every room. This this would be a great present too. Imagine a box under the Christmas tree, mm. right? <laughs> you don't know what's in that box. Yeah. And my grandson would say, what's in that box, Grandpa? Is that mine? I said, well, not quite, you know. <laughs> <laughs> not quite. And then when you open it and you see this shade, because you'd obviously put it in there completely uh, put together. Because when these arrive, they arrive in the beautiful boxes. Yep. The bulbs are in there. Mm -hmm. They're LED bulbs, so they don't burn that much electricity. Nice. You, they'll be a little cheaper to run. And you have to put them together carefully. Mm -hmm. And as I said, these, these shades are really strong. But yeah. don't drop them. Yeah, don't drop them, indeed, because you you would be dropping true art yeah. on the crowd, and that would be disappointing. I love the way that this shade kind of curves in. Yeah, it's beautiful, doesn't it? Come under here. Yeah. It has this undulation. You see, you can run your finger around it like this, and it sort of undulates. It just it's beautiful. And the, I like the orange colors. I do too. There, there's two tones of orange here. But you know what? I love the orange and again that amber glow, but I love that this has not only this really fiery red to it, but it has the most beautiful color of the sky blue. Can you see? Let me show you. Can, don't you love just this pops of light blue? Just the light coming through that is spectacular. And then of course the green. Yeah. Gorgeous. This is the first time I've seen this lit up. Yeah. And I must say, it's quite impressive. Well, what I like about it is the white up here. That's what I was saying. It's just a little bit different than yeah. the lamps that we had before. So, a beautiful look. I love the idea, we're talking so much about living rooms and putting this by the chair, maybe in your little reading area of your bedroom. But what about in your office, your home office, maybe you, you or someone you know on your holiday list, uh, spend so much time in their home yes. office. Imagine adding a Tiffany style light to that experience. It just makes it more inviting and you kind of get lost in a daydream looking at all of the beautiful. Well this one, when I'm just looking at it now, it has more of an Art Nouveau. It does feel about it, Agreed. doesn't it? Yeah. And uh, uh, Tiffany, when he was young, he was in Paris and mm -hmm. he, was, he came back with all the sense of Art Nouveau. And there was a wonderful man who was doing um, a, a wallpaper, creating these beautiful shapes and things. And he really loved all the design and, and the fluid uh, flow of the Art Nouveau. Yeah. And he loved color. He traveled in the Far East and he came back feeling quite frustrated walking into New York that was so gray and everyone was wearing black yeah. and gray <laughs> and brown. Whereas he had been in Africa and the buildings were painted and colored. Yeah, and totally different. India, where all the women were wearing those beautiful saris. So mm -hmm. suddenly color came back into his life. And when I saw that lamp, I don't know if I just mentioned it, but I saw that lamp for the first time. Yeah. And I, th I realized that Tiffany was an impressionist painter but he painted in glass, yes. like Degas, uh, Gauguin, uh, Van Gogh, uh -huh. would capture light uh -huh. and put that on canvas. Uh -huh. What he wanted to do was capture gotcha. the color of nature and put it into glass. Wow. And he loved dragonflies, he loved um, the frogs, and the, mm -hmm. the, the, he got his um, crabs from Oyster Bay, and in some of his pieces there's crabs at the base. I love it. It's beautiful. Well, 626-667 is your item number. Again, 24 in the...